This video illustrates some of the basic statistics functions done with the Casio FX260 calculator. The first thing is to go into SD mode. We press mode period and we see the little message SD on the top right of the screen. We're in statistics mode and we can enter some data. I'm going to enter the data 4, 5, 6, 8 and 9. 4 M plus enters the first data value and then I keep on doing this. 5 M plus. Now what if when I meant to enter a 6 I enter a 7 by mistake? To deal with this I do 7 shift M plus which is the M minus operation. It removes the 7. I can check by doing shift 6 which tells me my sample size and it says that I have a sample size of 2. Only the 4 and the 5 are still in there. The 7 is gone. Let's enter the rest of the data. 6 M plus, 8 M plus, 9 M plus. It's all in there. Let's check the sample size. Shift 6. Yes, there are 5 data values. To get the mean X bar, I press shift 7. The mean or average of this data is 6.4. To get the standard deviation, I press shift 8. And if I want the variance, which is just the square of the standard deviation, when I have the standard deviation showing, I press X squared. It squares it and this is our variance. Shift 5 gets sigma x and shift 4 gets sigma x squared. If I want to clear the stats memory from this calculator because I want to start a new problem, I can do so by doing mode period again. I am entering stats mode and clearing any remaining stats from the previous set of operations. This is how we use the Casio FX260 calculator to do some of the basic statistics functions.